Caroli Gross, Ka Roj Ro S, August 1, 1930 to January 7, 1996, was a Hungarian communist politician who served as the general secretary of the Hungarian Socialist Workers Party from 1988 to 1989. Topic: <laughs> Early career. Gross was born in Miskolc, Hungary. He joined the Communist Party in 1945 at the age of 14. The Communists took full power in 1949, and Gross rose through the party ranks, becoming an important party leader in his native region. He functioned as head of the Department of Agitation and Propaganda in the Bursa de Bauj Zemplin County branch of the Hungarian Working People's Party from 1954. He also held the position during the Hungarian Revolution of 1956, when he banned local journals from coverage of events and forced to remove Kossuth coat of arms from letterhead of local newspaper Esik Magai Erzig. On 4 November 1956, after the revolution was crushed, Gross was appointed head of the local party apparatus of the ruling Communist Party. In 1974 he was appointed head of the Department of Agitation and Propaganda of the governing Hungarian Socialist Workers' Party. In 1979 Gross was elected first secretary of the party committee of his home county. In 1984 he returned to national prominence as the head of the party committee in Budapest. At the next party congress in 1985, he became a member of the Politburo. In 1987, he was appointed Prime Minister of Hungary chairman of the Council of Ministers of the People's Republic of Hungary, the second most powerful position after that of General Secretary to succeed Georg Lazar, who had filled the post for more than 11 years. The appointment of the younger and more energetic Gross was acclaimed both at home and abroad. As the country was facing economic troubles and growing discontent, the aging party leader Janos Kader decided to resign, although originally he had planned to remain in office until 1990. In May 1988 a party conference was convened, which elected Karoli Gross as general secretary of the party at Kader's recommendation on May 22, 1988. He advocated moderate and measured changes in the political and economic spheres with the aim to accomplish a careful reform of socialism without touching the latter's foundations. He liked to call this a model change, i.e. reforms and refinements within the communist framework, as opposed to the total system change, i.e. the replacement of communism by a western-style system, advocated by a growing faction of radical reformers in the party. Topic. Leader of Hungary Gross remained Prime Minister until 24 November 1988, when he was succeeded by Miklos Német, a representative of the radical reformer faction. As 1989 wore on, Gross was increasingly sidelined by the radical reformers within the party, including Német, Rezo Nersh, Gyula Horn and Imre Pozge. He tried to slow down, stop or reverse the radical changes advocated by his adversaries that were aimed at establishing a liberal political system and market economy in Hungary. He opposed the rehabilitation of the executed Imre Nagy, prime minister during the 1956 revolution. In order to prevent Nagy's political rehabilitation, Gross gave a speech before the Central Committee of the Hungarian Socialist Workers' Party on 1 September 1989, where he provided some information on the former Prime Minister's alleged NKVD ties. However, the committee decided not to publish the charges. Gross's fate was sealed when he agreed to meet with Romanian leader Nicolae Ceausescu to discuss what to do with a large number of ethnic Hungarians who had fled Romania. Many of Gross' party colleagues thought he trusted Ceausescu too much. He lost a good deal of authority as a result, and his standing never really recovered. On 26 June 1989, he became a member of a four-man collective presidency of the MSZMP, chaired by Nersh. Although Gross retained his post as general secretary, Nersh now outranked him and thus replaced him as the de facto leader of Hungary. However, he opposed the radical reformers' drive to reorganize the party as a social democratic party. He remained general secretary until October 7, when the party reorganized itself as the Hungarian Socialist Party. Topic. Later life The communist hard line 
faction, led by Gross, was defeated at the Congress and broke away in December 1989 as a new Hungarian Socialist Workers' Party, with Gross as its first acting chairman later renamed Workers' Party and the Communist Workers' Party. The party failed to win parliamentary representation in the first multi-party election in the newly formed Republic of Hungary. These elections took place on the 25th of March and the 8th of April 1990. On the 7th of January 1996, he died of kidney cancer at age 65 in Gadalo, Hungary. Topic notes. <laughs>